zombies. Now, if you look at me, I don't know if you would think that I would be a zombie enthusiast, but oh boy, trust me, I'm like one of the biggest that you'll ever meet. Which is really weird because it's like, I'm, I'm a nice guy, I'm pretty chill, you know? I don't have the demeanor that I would like slaughtering a bunch of was humans, you know? But I am, and that's weird. But it's like, why do I like it? Well, I think first I need to start off with how it all started for me, right? So, I remember in like 2012, 2013, went to Zach's house, and we all played Black Ops Zombies. I think that was the first time I played it, and I, I really liked it, probably a lot more than I should have. <laughs> and then I also remember that because I started off with that, I know my cousin at one point in time, around the same time, also got an Xbox, also got Black Ops, so we played that. So, I've been playing zombies since I was like 12, 13. I've been in contact with like the zombie media for around like 8 years now. So I've kind of seen the rise and fall of it and everything, and it's really interesting too. This, there's no way this is going to be a main video because it's way too dark and depressing for, for a main channel video. My, my main channel is like very um, uplifting and encouraging, or at least I try to make it because like we need more content like that. But this second channel, I can do whatever I want. I can even video titled zombies and nobody's gonna expect it because it's like this channel's been dead for so long but I want to do more stuff like this where it's just like me talking about stuff kind of like what I did with Kingdom Hearts um, where I, I, I reviewed it but it wasn't a main channel video it's just like a, hey this is a thing um, should I be working right now shut up <laughs> but yes uh, because like this over here um, I, I should be you see that a project file uh, test edit that's due like 6 p.m. Uh, today and it's uh, 10 30 and should I be working on it yeah but I've been like oh procrastination man is has been really hitting me recently 2012 2013 first encounter with zombies and for the next few years I kind of I played those kind of games black ops 2 came out and that was when for me it was at its height when when black ops 2 came out because before then we were all playing Black Ops 1 Zombies with friends, you know. I played Left 4 Dead with my one friend Calvin. That was fun, so that introduced me to a, a wider um, range of zombies. However, I got in trouble because my mom found Left 4 Dead 2 on my shelf. And I was like 13, <laughs> so that wasn't the best. Um, <laughs> but it happened. What was funny is like it was on this shelf over here for for a long time and I like I never played it I just had it on my shelf it was like what so then after that point around 2014 actually no I think it was still around 2012 2013 2014 around that era because that's when Black Ops 2 came out and before that I actually had an Xbox so I got my Xbox in like I think 2013 which means I've had my Xbox 360 for seven years which oh my gosh I'm old I, I love Halo that's a separate video separate I love Halo to death I should make a separate video on that because that's cool love Halo Reach. Love it to death. It is still the most beautiful Halo to me, in my opinion. When I got my Xbox and then Black Ops 2 came out, I pre-ordered that, man. Ooh. Actually, I think it was 2015 that Black Ops 2 came out. Fact check. I don't, I don't know. Don't. Dude, I stayed up so late with friends playing Transit. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That was so much fun. Having a full squad playing Transit. Oh, I, oh. Dude, I'm feeling emotions right now. Oh my gosh, I'm so nostalgic. I, I like, I'm imagining the gameplay, the the opening screen map right now. The da da oh ho, oh, oh, it's so good. And like, it's still good to this day. It's not the best zombie map ever. The transit played that for so long with friends for probably like a year. We would all get on transit after uh, school, and we would just play that. Uh, and that was like the golden years of like my xbox days after a while everybody started playing their own games i started playing minecraft on the xbox with friends um and the zombie thing kind of died down at the same time however this was when walking dead kind of started like around this time so like 2010 2013 that's when it, like everybody started watching it. it's like oh walking dead great show i never watched it at that time we all pre-ordered it so we all got the dlcs as they came out so that way people kept going to the game wanting to play it because new new maps so oh i want to play this game so the other one was um why am i blanking on the name die rise was the skyscraper one i think that was another huge map for our squad we played that a lot especially when it came out we kind of forgot about transit we played it once in a while but 
Die Rise was like the main map we always used to play. And then we kind of just played a bunch of different games that weren't really zombie related. The only game I can think of is Dead Rising, but I don't think I played it on Xbox. Actually, no, I did play Dead Rising on Xbox. At some point in time, actually, I think around the same time, like 2014-ish, 2015, I don't know when this came out, but around that time, I started playing the Walking Dead Telltale series. And that was the first zombie game I played that had a story and that had like a choose your own adventure aspect, which is why uh, I made a video about Telltale on my main channel so long ago because when they got shut down, I was devastated because I love Telltale in general. Like I love the choose your own adventure aspect. I think it's really cool. And I don't see a lot of other games doing that. So I think Telltale was like the good like stepping off point to make you realize, oh yeah, we can do that in video games. I think it was the first big successful version of that, which is really cool. So I played that to death. Love the story. Lee, his name is Lee. I really loved Lee and I love the Lee Clementine dynamic. Oh my gosh, dude. Dude, that, that PewDiePie scene of him crying. Oh, it's real. Oh, it's real. Oh my gosh, yeah. Uh, ooh, I felt that. So then finished Walking Dead, and then I played the season two game when it came out. I don't know when it came out. Um, Dead Rising, I also played after that era, I think. So, Walking Dead first, and then Dead Rising. I've never played the first, first one, and I've never played the third one. I played the second one. I don't think I ever finished it. I eventually got it on my PC and I have it on there now, but I still haven't finished it. After the Walking Dead phase, for me, I think zombie media, like the only thing we would play occasionally is Black Ops Zombies. And then I think for me, the resurgence happened last year. We started playing Black Ops Zombies again. And because of that, I went on a trip. So that was really fun. And then on my trip, I was in my hotel room and I had Netflix. So I watched BoJack for a second time. And then eventually I saw Walking Dead in my queue and I'm like, this has been in my queue for literal years. I'm just gonna start watching it. And now I'm on season four. <laughs> really good show. I don't like how Critical hates it, but fair enough. The first six episodes are basically like a foundation, a good foundation. And he didn't even get past that. So it's like, oh. But I mean, I loved it from the very beginning. It is a show that centers people in a world. The story isn't necessarily about the zombies. It's about the people in the world. So it can get really dramatic really fast. And it like, there were really suspenseful moments where I was like huddled up and I'm like, oh my gosh, like I was literally on the edge of my seat. And then recently I bought Dead Rising 4 which I'm addicted to right now, which is kind of what sparked this whole video because I was thinking about Dead Rising 4 and I'm like, I could make a video about zombies. And I'm like, but main channel, no. For so many reasons, no. And I'm like, but I have a side channel. I have a side channel, ooh. And so I was like, oh, I could do whatever I want on this channel because nobody's watching it anyways. But no, that's kind of my history with zombies. I, I've, I've never seen a video talking about like somebody's experience with zombies like in general i'd love to hear everybody else's stories actually i would challenge you if you're watching this right now i'd love for you to make a video reply to this post the link in the comments and i will watch it we'll have a great time nostalgicizing that's not a word shut up nostalgicizing over zombies because it is a media that is extremely niche even though walking dead kind of blew it up so is it niche i mean it's kind of niche now i haven't really met anybody besides like my friends who like really like zombies i wonder if anybody else feels this way because uh it's weird but why i think the question is why do i like zombies i have always been interested in the fact of like a a social plague taking over society and ruining it. oh that's kind of well that's happening now <laughs> never mind uh now now but like i still like zombies because i i feel like it is a very interesting way to kind of put a bunch of different people in this same world but every time it happens it always happens differently and there's always different variations of zombies and like world building even though you know zombies well these zombies are different left 4 dead zombies are different from walking dead zombies walking dead zombies are different from call of duty zombies 
Dead Rising zombies are like literally the weakest things ever where you can go into a horde of 300 with your fists and kill them all. Like they're not a threat at all and you don't get infected. Unlike Walking Dead zombies where they're equally as slow but everybody's afraid of them. And the reason for this diversity I think is because the original movie I think it was did not have a copyright on zombies. So literally because of that Zombies is literally like a free domain type copyright thing. I'm not 100% sure, but that's where it started. So because of that one thing, and now everybody like has been taking from zombies. And I'm kind of glad people did because now we have all these variations of zombies. And I really like that. I think that's really cool. Yeah, so I think that's it. Do I seem like the kind of person that likes zombies? I don't think so, which is why I think this video will kind of be a surprise to some people. Um, but yeah. I think that's it, so I gotta get to work. I should have been working this entire time, but you know, I wanted to talk about this because I haven't done this in a while. Also, I just released a main channel video yesterday, so check that out if you have not, because it's really good, and I spent a month, over a month on it, and did a few things different, so that's cool. I'm, I'm proud of it. If you haven't seen the main channel video, go watch it. It's great. It's about a great game. Love it. Alright, I'm done. Zombies are great.